Some of the goals that we have really are to play consistently well and play our best ball as we get towards the end of the season. Um, like everyone, we've been working on a lot of things um, with the mental game as well as obviously just being better softball players and we're excited to see those things in motion now that season is, is upon us. But truly just playing our best ball at the end of the year, coming together like we should to compete every day. We had a great group that graduated, no doubt about it, but we couldn't be more pleased with the people that we have coming in this year. You know, our freshman group with Tiana and Carissa and Taylor had done a great job. We also have the addition of Lurie Mitchell as a transfer. And so they've really added um, aspects of the game that have just been tremendous. So I don't, I don't think you're, you're ever going to really replace people, but we're excited about what our newcomers have added. And, and I think you're going to see some uh, pretty good things out of all of them this season. The facility's been amazing. Um, you know, we used to be on a gym floor like a lot of people in this kind of climate, and now the fact that we can, you know, get on turf and, and slide and, and scrimmage, we have netting around so we can actually swing a bat in this situation versus just in the cages, has been absolutely amazing. The kids love it, the coaches love it, and I'm sure it's going to end up showing up for us just having solid starts at the beginning of the year. You know, it's, it's great just to have the tournament happen. We're, we're, we're at that point where we practiced uh, for several weeks now. Um, actually, even going back to the fall, we're ready to get this underway. And the fact that we can go again to Rosemont and play in the, in the Dome is incredible. We have a great partnership with Loyola to do that. We're, we're really thrilled about that. Um, as far as the competition, again, we've had solid teams coming in. Um, probably one of the best teams, Central Michigan. We're playing them on Sunday. Uh, they've consistently had a solid program under Margo Yonker. Uh, it's fun to play Butler. You know, Butler was in our conference a few years ago, and Scott does a great job with them. Um, teams that we haven't faced before, you know, we haven't faced North Dakota in a while, and they have a new coach, and we haven't seen Syracuse. So for us, it's going to be about playing our game, doing the things that, that we want to accomplish, and knowing that if we stay within that process, that it, it doesn't matter who we play, but we just want to, again, get better every chance that we have.